Boston in an early one-game hole after being handled easily by Orlando in the series opener. Stan Van Gundy, however, unhappy with the way his team won after almost giving up a 28-point lead. Ray Allen and Rajon Rondo struggled in the opening game, but they picked it up in this one, especially Ray Ray. He had 22 points in this ball game. Up and under puts Boston up 22-13. On the other end, though, it's J.J. Redick with an answer. Three up and three down. He had 11 points the first 24 minutes. Boston still up by six. Later, Rondo drives, going to bank the floater. Given the season 26-19 edge, heading into the second quarter. Some defense. Glenn Davis with the steal here. He's going to get it to Eddie House, who lays it in. But take a second look here. Looks like Big Baby may have gotten away with one. He's out of bounds, but they didn't catch it. A bit later, Scalabrini up top to Eddie House, who is stroking the three ball. He had a monster game. Paul Pierce, limited minutes in this ball game because of foul trouble, and Eddie House really took advantage. Meanwhile, Dwight Howard down low for the big slam. Struggled a bit in the first half. Four of ten from the field, just nine points. Kendrick Perkins, a beast in the first two quarters. 14 points, finished with 16. His team led by 15 at the break. Third quarter, it's Howard. Giving Perkins the business here. That's so nice. You got to see it twice. Get out of the way, young fella. 21-point lead for Boston now. Check out Rondo. He'll catch you sleeping, coming through, rocking the rim. Defense now for Rondo. Gets the steal. How about his third triple-double of the playoffs? 15 points, 11 boards, 18 assists. Eddie House, as I mentioned, a monster night for him. Picking up the minutes for Paul Pierce. Hitting the three. Ray for Austin doesn't like it. Slaps him in the back of the head. They have some words. And Austin's going to head to the bench after a frustrating night. House, meanwhile, continuing to pour it on. Four for four from the great beyond. Gets this one to go with the foul. He converted on the free throw as well. How about 31 points off the bench for him? That's a career high. Also the most off the bench for Boston in a playoff game. In nearly 15 years, the season, even the series 1-1, headed to Orlando, game three on.